Hello, the fuse keeps blowing on Cup Cadet LTX 1046. When I replace it and reconnect the battery it blows again. It blew first when I was trying to start the engine. Is this a problem with the starter? When did you last clean or perform maintenance on your Cub Cadet tool or machine? How old is it? Had it in the shop last year for tune-up. It is about 12 years old. What have you tried so far with your Cub Cadet? Just replacing the fuse. Is there anything else the engine expert should know before I connect you? Rest assured that they'll be able to help you. I don't think so. Welcome to Just Answer. Hello. This is Brian the Mom Answer Man. I can help you. I have a Cub Cadet and the fuse blows when I reconnect the battery. The first time it blew is when I was trying to start it. It turned over a few times and they got stuck and quit. As soon as I replaced the Fue it reconnected the battery it blew again. There is an article written by Paul Bright that does a beautiful job of outlining why the fuse may blow. Please see the answer below. Below. After reading all of the possible causes. Unless you are a good mechanic, I imagine that you may decide to that it is time for another visit to the shop. Read it and tell me what you think. Ignition system Whenever you turn the key on your Cub Cadet mower's ignition, a small electrical charge is sent from the ignition switch to the magneto. The magneto's flywheel is activated and spins a magnet around two sets of copper wires stacked on top of each other. These wires can generate up to 10,000 volts for the spark plug. If something interrupts or damages the magneto or ignition system, it's possible that the voltage can become errant and blow the fuse due to current overload. Alternator stator A problem with the alternator can cause a fuse to blow in your Cub Cadet lawn mower. The alternator system is responsible for keeping your battery charged during operation by changing the current from AC to DC. The stator is made of copper wires and powers the alternator when the magnet on the rotor spins past it at high speed. This electricity passes through a diode to your battery. If the stator generates too much electricity, it can overload the Cub Cadet electrical system and blow the fuse. Voltage regulator electricity on your Cub Cadet mower must be controlled whenever it travels from system to system. Models of other brands sometimes use a voltage regulator, also known as a rectifier. The voltage regulator controls how much voltage is sent back to the battery. While more modern alternators have this built in, older engines have it as a separate system. A short in the voltage regulator can send an incorrect amount of electric charge to the battery and cause an overload, thus blowing a fuse. Wire condition to prevent electrical surges, consider inspecting the wires on all electrical parts. Look for obvious tears, damage and pinching, especially in leads from the ignition system or battery. Also ensure that all wires are in their correct place. Positive wires are often red and identified with a plus sign, while negative wires are black with a minus sign. There may also be a separate ground wire that is supposed to connect to a metal part separate from the component. The fuse blows before I have a chance to turn the key. Does this mean anything? The wiring may have a short. Sounds like the starter motor is not the problem. Agreed. Okay, thanks. Any other suggestions? This is Al that I accurately tell you. 
I am sigging off now. If I have been helpful, then I appreciate a 5 star review thanks. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.